Hey, Storm Shielders, meteorologist Jason Myers here. I am about to answer the question that you have been asking for months now. What kind of winter will we have? Are we going to see another polar vortex? Will we get a lot of snow this winter? Are we finally going to see some rain in Texas and California where the drought has been going on for? Ever. Well, the Climate Prediction Center has finally released their outlook for the next few months. It looks like they're pretty much going with El Nino, and that means cooler temperatures in the south. So really from New Mexico all the way through Texas, Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, Georgia, even parts of Florida, seeing some cooler than average temperatures, staying hot in the west coast. I know you guys don't want to hear that, and it looks like warmer than average in the northeast, and an equal chance of seeing a, really about an average winter in the middle of the country. As for rain and snow, good news. Wet conditions in the south where we could really use the rain to help in that drought. Doesn't look like it'll be ending the drought, but it'll definitely ease conditions. Drought conditions in the rest of California and the Pacific Northwest looks like those are going to persist. Uh, in the Midwest, where you saw a lot of snow last winter, well, it looks like you won't be getting that again this winter. It looks like a good chance to see some drier conditions everywhere else. Equal conditions, uh, equal chances to see a uh, about an average winter as far as precipitation goes. So there you have it. That's what kind of winter you're going to be having. Either way, let's just take it as it comes, bundle up when it's cold, and enjoy those warmer than average days when they do arrive. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.